let's just look at the assault weapons ban. Yep. We had one in this country for 10 years. Every single weapon used by the shooter in Connecticut yep. would have been okay under the old assault weapons law. They were all exceptions. Yeah, okay, so the law was flawed. Fix it. Isn't it pretty hard to define what is an assault weapon? Because it's so easy to write around for manufacturers to create weapons that... Well, if it can fire a lot of bullets very quickly, that's a good definite, good place to start, okay? And, and then you would can say, argue what a lot is. Okay, let's pick it. Let's say three. If you haven't hit the deer with three shots, you're a pretty lousy shot. That deer deserves to get away. Let's get serious here. But that would ban most pistols. That would ban most... No, but pistols are different. You have to pull the trigger each time. An assault weapon, you basically hold it, goes... No, those are fully automatic weapons. Okay. So fully automatic if weapons. If you have a big magazine you'll solve your problem. You still have to pull a trigger, but if it's 30 bullets or 20 bullets or 10 bullets before you run out, I would suggest the deer is, God wants that deer to live. But according to gun owners, what you've just described would ban most guns that hunters use today. If that's what they're using, for God's sakes, why don't they use dynamite? Just make it easier. I mean, what's the sport? The position that a lot of people are going to say is all you're going to accomplish is taking guns away from the good people and the bad people are still going to No, 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 that's not true. The statistics say that if you have a gun at home, you are 22 times as likely to shoot a family member or a friend as to somebody breaking in. Don't try to go for a gun. You've got somebody pointing a gun at you. You think you're going to be able to outshoot them? That's one of the stupidest things I've ever heard.